Hi guys, it's me, Jessica, AKA She's a Jordan. I am making a YouTube video. I know y'all like, hop on who this woman? Like I have not made a video in ages, but I've had a few requests and for the people who did love my videos, I kind of felt bad that I was just like, I don't feel like making a YouTube video. And I guess in my mind, if it wasn't something that I was here and I was loving, that my content would reflect it. And who wants to watch a video that somebody didn't feel like making? Like, that's just, that's not fair. So, um, but I was tagged by Karis, um, LB Lover CC, to do a tag video. And you're supposed to take your name and for each letter um use it for something that you love but my name is so like the same letter like it's a j and some s's that i felt like it would be like a short change so if i come across something that is one of the letters in my name then i'll use it but other than that i wanted to share with you guys what i am have truly 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 been loving and using um over the last um year year and a half or however long it's been since i made a video now if you guys follow me on instagram i'm still there i love instagram i'll post a story so you kind of know what's been going on in my life um for people who do not follow me on instagram and only watch my youtube videos you remember that we lived in germany and then we moved to louisiana and now we're here in virginia and i love virginia it is so nice um but through all of those things i finished grad school so i have a master's degree in healthcare administration and i now work for the united states government um and i am so in love with my job it um is everything that i wanted in a career um i am my birthday just passed i turned 39 and for the majority of my late 20s and all of my 30s, I've been with my husband who was in the Air Force. And we have traveled. And during some of those years, seven of them, six of them, I was getting um, my degrees. And so now I'm finished with school completely. And now I am a full grown adult who has a job, a wife, and a husband. Can you believe it? Jessica from Detroit, little brown girl, is like a full on contributor to society in a great way so with that see that's just like a little bit of what's been going on in our lives these are the things that i've been loving um i've been going to orange theory for maybe a year um right around the time we got here and i wanted to start you know just being healthy like um i've put on weight that i cannot get rid of like i just don't know what it is but i do i am physically fit like i go to orange theory we do weights we do the um rower we do um the treadmill and it's it's called the 3g so you do all three in the 60 minute burn and i burn in a day probably about 900 calories easy and i close all my rings i eat decent like i'm not counting calories or anything but i do try and eat really well um but it's just not coming up so i'm going to try to do more cardio i think that's my issue when i do cardio i do really well but this is like weight lifting and so i'm i'm gaining muscle and i can feel the strength like i can run two miles without stopping like that is a big deal a lot of people can't run two miles is what my husband told me but i can literally hit and run two miles and I love it. So um, that's just a whole nother story. Anyway, my favorite things. We're back to the things that I love. So Orange Theory is one of those things that I truly, truly love. And when I go to Orange Theory, I wear my running shoes, which are my murals. And these guys are flat as pancakes. But I used to deal with like shin splints and my knees would hurt. And I was like, what is going on? So one of the people that go to Orange Theory, um, one of the coaches said... Um, it's the shoe that you're wearing. When you have all of these issues, your foot is trying to conform to the shoe instead of the shoe conforming to your foot. 
and I tell you what these were like 120 bucks of course I got the green and then I added the pink shoelaces because it just it just says Jessica and so I mean it's super duper like I mean the shoe is literally flat but it's a mural barefoot vibram sole and it is the best shoe I have ever um purchased i got them the mirror website didn't have them but they did have them on amazon and if i can link this stuff i will and then i got the a black pair these are not as flexible but they're the same um barefoot and i wear these um when i'm out like if i'm shopping or something if i'm doing something i'll wear these i don't wear these to the gym i only wear the lime green ones and i bought a blue pair because i wanted to have a second pair because that's how much i love them anything that you see in this video is something that i love like i literally use it every day i wear it i'm not in any way selling it like oh you should buy this because they send it to me for free absolutely every single thing in this video i purchased with my own my husband's own money this is my hydro flask i have a hydro flask water bottle and now i have the coffee cup now i got this from dick sporting goods and they sold the stickers so i bought one that's this one says smile and then this is like a sunflower i use it i drink my coffee out of it since the day that i got it i have not used any other mug a starbucks mug or anything so and my hydro flask water bottle is gray and it's got um, i don't have it in i think it's because i take it to the gym um it's it's a gray one and i put black stars and a couple other things on it so i decorated it because i don't know i think it, everything should be personalized if we can personalize so this makes me happy and this is hydro flask it keeps my coffee warmer longer because i sip coffee slowly throughout the day as i sit i'm at my desk so my husband created me a little office space in our garage so that's why you see like chairs and other things because this is our garage but the beautiful thing about it is we have windows in our garage so it makes it feel like i'm not in some kind of dark hole what else do i love um the thayer's toner when i first got this i thought it was the worst stuff and i stopped using it and then i ran out of the other toner that i had i was like well let me just use it and the more i use it the more i like it so that is something that i have to say um try it you know what i'm saying and don't and don't use it once or twice like literally use it and then make an opinion and so this stuff and then I then I turned around and bought the witch hazel one the other day because I was like when I bought it I didn't necessarily like it and then something I bought the witch hazel I think that's what it's called the witch hazel doctor something I can't even think of what it is and then I used it and I do like it but I like this more and as you can see the bottle is wet and it's empty because I literally use this down to nothing um the goalie apple cider vinegar peels now these are like 20 bucks a bottle and i take two to four a day but i've gone through four or five bottles of this um so i use it i love it i use it and it makes me feel really good i enjoy the goalie apple cider vinegar because i wanted to take apple cider vinegar i just couldn't swallow it every single day like i can take a teaspoon here a teaspoon there but monday through sunday i can't so i bought i discovered these i'm so sure you guys have seen these on your timelines try them they really really are really good if y'all know i have been a acne sufferer for like ever and so a couple products i've gone through i didn't really talk about them a lot because they nece didn't necessarily fit in and work so you can see my skin i do have a a breakout here um but for the most part it has been doing really well this is my second bottle of kate summersville anti bag and i ran out of it and i noticed that when i stopped using this i started getting flare-ups so i had to order it online i went to nordstrom's and got my first bottle a while ago when i first got to here and they um since has closed the notion that was in north folk um so i had to go online and i ordered it and between running out and getting it from online i started to break out so i attribute kate summersville anti-back acne clearing lotion to helping my skin be better it's better self i've also been using um urban skin rx now once again i'm showing you things that i have literally like there's literally 
I did have a little bit in this bottle. Like it's pretty much empty. And I'm gonna put this on our face. There we go. Um, but as you can see, it's pretty much empty. I didn't realize I had that much in there, but as you can see, I had to turn it all the way upside down. This, I've used it till, I use it this morning. I do have another one upstairs that's brand new, but I use this to wash my face. This is the serum that I use. I love it. It is like the best um, acne. It's the best skin regimen for people that have melanin, brown skin. That's probably why I like it so much. But it does it does work. But it's melanin. Like it's designed for people who have melanin in their skin, which I do, as you can see. I'm on the African American side of things. I am black, mixed with black. Okay. Um, oh, my hair. People <laughs> say so your hair grows so fast. I use this hair, skin, and nails. I cut my hair off about two years ago. And now I, if you follow me on screen, you know I have hair now. Like I literally have hair that goes in a ponytail and everything so I do take these as you can see I have one left how it's supposed to take two so I'm trying to figure out did I take three one day did I drop one on the floor and have to throw it away or whatever but I use these I've had bottles and bottles actually CVS sometimes or Walgreens um, has these buy one get one free and this is the second of the free one that I got I do have another one that I bought the other day but I still have one in here so these are things that I literally use on my skin on in my body that I wear that I love these are not things that I'm just saying you should get because um I'm saying get them like these are things that I really really love and I think that I I stopped making YouTube videos because I loved it, but I didn't use it. So <laughs> these are bags that, like my Boss 4 LV backpack, I haven't put anything inside of it in like two years. Like I just haven't even reached for it. Now, will I sell it? No, it's one of a kind, they don't make them anymore. So of course I'm not gonna get rid of it um, because there will come a day that I'm like, oh, let me wear my LV backpack. But for now, quarantine, working from home, like, there is literally no reason to have a backpack. Literally no reason to have a backpack. Um, so yeah, but what I do use, because I do leave the house on occasion, um, is this clear bag from freaking Amazon. <laughs> now inside of it are the things, this is the clear crossbody bag. Everybody has one of these bags. Um, I have been using my Gucci wallet, um, my, um, key play, it has keys, my car keys in it, and my mini pochette. These are just the things out of all of the SLGs, I probably have SLGs that I have not touched literally since I left Germany. Um, but this little bag, it comes from Amazon, it's from Lamb Glam or something like that, <laughs> and it was like 30 bucks but i use it and i love it um another bag that i have been using um during the pandemic um or just since i've been home and not really going a lot of places is this this bag i have had since um i was t like 22 or something like that i got it from somerset collections louis vuitton and it is literally the oldest bag i have inside of it i put my cell phone i have um, my hermes bastia um this is my wallet this is the louis vuitton rosalie i think it is called um i have a lululemon tag um i'm literally chapstick i put on lip gloss because i came on here today with y'all and some mentos like that's literally what's in here and then i put my phone and then my mask um this strap comes off my pochette matisse which i haven't worn in forever either it's just in the little cubby hole but this is the older pochette accessories and um this chain i have been looking for something i got it from the hrh collections i'm not sure about her um but her quality of her pieces is really really good um so i bought it and it's been working really well. I think it gives the bag something across body. I take it to the gym. I cross it 
um, when I go, I hang it on the thing. And then I, when I go into Target and things like that, I take it. Another bag that I still carry um, a lot is my, um, what is this? Um, my backpack. This is the mini, the Palm Springs backpack, the mini. This chain I got as a free gift when I ordered that pink chain. Um, anyway, I think it fits the bag really nicely and it gives me the ability to zip and unzip um nicely and I crossbody it and then I bought this strap separately um this is the extra something bandolier I um I can't even think of it extra large man it's a bandolier strap from Louis Vuitton I got it when I lived in Germany um and it does adjust and the only bag that I generally carry this on is this because I feel like the black matches so beautifully and this is one of this has been for the time that I've had it one of my favorite purses like I love this bag so I carry it a lot with those things the other thing that um has been crazy is this pandemic and wearing a mask and all of these things so I ordered this little pouch thing from Shein and it's a sanitary napkin pouch but I put mask in it so when I'm using my mask if I have to take it off I fold it and then I slide it in here I have a blue light sanitizer that I sanitize on my mask with um, if I'm wearing them I usually just wash them I usually only wear them once a time and then I sanitize them but the sanitizer also has a fragrance um, infuser so you put your essential oils in it so like my mask that are the extra spare clean ones smell like lemon they smell really good i buy these from old navy they come in a pack i have a bunch of different masks if you guys follow me on instagram you know that i'm a mask um lover but when i wash them i iron them down to make them look flat and i infuse them with scent so when i put my mask on my ding dang face it doesn't smell funny or you know it just smells really good it's not like just a basic scent it's like lemongrass or lavender um the essential oils i just drop it in there it gives it infuses it with the essential oil and when my husband puts his mask on and my daughter they're like oh it smells so good and this will be like the mask of the day like i would take it off at a restaurant and put it in there and then i have a clean mask i don't know i got them from old navy so check old navy out um they have a really good selection of masks i think oh last but not least lou lou lemon when i tell y'all i love me some lou lemon i love like cult like lou lemon um I started wearing Lululemon here. I had never, I, like I seen it, but I never had done any research, didn't care about it. Um, but they make clothes for people like me. People who, comfort is the number one thing. If I'm not comfortable, I'm not. It's just not gonna happen. But I'm at home and I am I wanna still get dressed. Like I don't wanna just wear pajamas and Lululemon's clothing is, even their stuff that you're supposed to work out in i don't work out in lululemon i wear it um like throughout life and i work out in other stuff like i like um 90 degree reflex i think that's what it's called i like their leggings to work out in. i have a ton of those um i have shirts and stuff that i work out in but when i'm wearing this i wear this shirt on my birthday it of course is wrinkled i hung it up after i washed it but this is from Lululemon and it is so stinking cute. I wore it with like black leggings. Um, this is one of their sports bras. I got this online. Everything has a name. So this is like the invigorate something or another. And it tells you when you go on there, it tells you what the clothes are designed for. Um, so this is designed for like a medium to light low impact workout i wear it under um my clothing yesterday we went to lululemon and i got the oh this one has a tag on it so i can tell you what it is this is the um this is a zip bra 
and I have the zip bra that I work out in. Now these I bought, I bought four, three of these, these bras and I do actually work out in them every day that I go to the gym. I found that I like bras that zip in the front to work out because when you're sweaty, it's so much easier to take off. So I wear this and with this, I don't have to wear anything other than like this tank top. It's like a fitted um, shirt that goes over my workout bras. I have four of them, then I have four of these. So I'm able to work out four days, then I wash them, and then I work out four more days. But this is really super stretchy, and it does have the adjustable right here. So when I went into the store yesterday, I wanted one that was not necessarily for working out that I could actually wear. Um under my clothes because I'm not a fan of wire bras anymore but because I am very top heavy this bra I wear a 36e I have boobies and I did pay $108 for it but that's not the issue the issue is how well the stupid thing fits and you get what you pay for it and the straps in the back when I tell you this bra will hold you like nothing i've ever experienced it will hold you once again this is my lululemon top i love that shirt i wear as much as i can and i also when i was in there i found these soft ambitious shorts um a size 10 they were 78 dollars this one is the i want to say it's a newer line because they spell out lululemon instead of having their symbol but these are the softest four inch thick shorts but cool they have pockets um it even has like a little pocket inside the pocket um now lululemon stuff is on the pricey side i mean but if you find something that you love i always say if you love it get it wear it use it and so that's what i do um i was standing at the checkout line and they had hair ties now because i have braids i've been wearing my hair up to the gym and I just thought it was appropriate to buy a scrunchie and this scrunchie is reflective so if I'm out running at night you know because I run at night all the time <laughs> if, <laughs> lying I'm lying I'm being sarcastic I'll put this in my hair I didn't realize I paid $14 for it till I got home and then I felt kind of crazy I was like why did you buy a $14 scrunchie but it's in my house I'm gonna wear it to um the gym today and it's got the little little lemon sign so stinking cute and pink is my like color so yeah um i don't even i think i missed the whole alphabet thing but these are the things that i love that's what's me going on in my life um i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you have any questions um go ahead and leave them down below um i will link i don't know if i'm gonna link this stuff guys i might link some of it the linking is going to be hard. I'm kind of lazy, so I don't want to say that I will or that I won't. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. I did enjoy making it. I haven't filmed a video in so long. Um, I'm probably rusty. I probably talked fast, but that's what I got. So I will see you guys later. And once again, please follow me on Instagram. Um, that is the best way to keep up if you're interested in what I'm doing is on Instagram. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.